Um, hi, I'm Kathy. I'm a freshman at Lincoln Northeast. <laughs> this is my poem, Breathe. Sometimes I'm a kid. I laugh with my siblings, I play in the snow, I jump on trampolines, I manage to ride my bike for almost an hour in our small neighborhood without getting bored, and I eat way too much candy than what is even remotely healthy. And sometimes I have to push down the adult in me, the part of me that doesn't sleep and feeds my siblings at night when my mom is gone at work, that makes sure my little sister did her homework and that she played outside, and that forces me to get out of my warm bed to triple check that the stove is off and the locks are set because what if I miss something? It would be my fault if we all end up dead. Sometimes I have to push down the part of me that worries so I can smile and I can laugh and I can put off my homework because what does it matter? You only live once. At least that's what they've said. But at 3 a.m. I'm doing the homework I pushed off till the end because you'll never get into the college of your mother's dreams by slacking off. A few more words, go back again, retype, it's 4 a.m., send. A tickophobia, defined as the abnormal, unwarranted, and persistent fear of failure. A sick joke. A tickophobia, in other words, a tick I fear, a broken clock spinning sporadically on a centerpiece of senseless speech, of words and thoughts haphazardly thrown around in a messed up jumble in my head. I'm getting ahead of rationality and instinct, and everything is telling me to just breathe. And be a kid for real. Breathe, I don't need to get out of bed, I already checked. Breathe, they've eaten, they're full, have you eaten yet? Breathe, the homework's not due for a while longer. Just go watch that new TV series. Breathe, the world hasn't fallen apart yet. Breathe and sleep to the ticking of a clock back on track like a metronome setting the beat. Just breathe. Yeah.